Devon Medical Products ExtraCare 3600 Negative Pressure Wound Therapy Pump is a clinical grade, portable, battery powered device which may promote wound healing through the removal of wound exudates, infectious material, and tissue debris from the wound bed using continuous and or intermittent negative pressure. This pump works with all Devon Medical Products ExtraCare all-in-one bandage dressings and foam kits. Our ExtraCare 3600 system comes equipped with a power adapter, a rail clamp, a 400cc canister, and a user manual. Dressings, foam kits, additional and various sized canisters, carrying cases, and other accessories are sold separately. Please follow along as we take you through the different steps on how to operate our ExtraCare 3600 pump. To turn on the ExtraCare 3600 pump, flip the power switch located on the back panel of the device. The screen will display the starting image and the system will complete a self-check. After the self-check, the device will display the standby screen. The ExtraCare 3600 has a default pressure of 125 millimeters of mercury. To change the pressure, press the up or down buttons. The pressure will change in increments of 5 millimeters of mercury with a range of 40 millimeters of mercury to 200 millimeters of mercury. By holding down the up or down button, the pressure will change continuously in 5 millimeters of mercury increments. To change the operating mode, press and hold the mode button until the mode icon changes. The ExtraCare 3600 can operate in continuous or intermittent mode. If operating in continuous mode, a solid line will be displayed on the screen and the device will operate at the pressure set by the user. If the device is operating in intermittent mode, a dashed line will be displayed on the screen and the ExtraCare 3600 will operate for five minutes at the set pressure, for two minutes at 20 millimeters of mercury, and then will repeat. The ExtraCare 3600 pump will automatically lock if the device is inactive for three minutes. If this occurs, pressing the buttons will illuminate the screen, but the settings will not change. To manually lock the device, press and hold the mode and start stop buttons for two seconds. To unlock the device, press and hold the mode and start stop buttons for two seconds. If an alarm sounds when the device is locked, the backlight to the screen will turn on and the alarm will display. To start or stop treatment, press the Start Stop button for two seconds. A rail clamp is provided to hang the device if necessary. To use the rail clamp, insert the clamp board firmly into the socket located at the back of the device. Release the screw on the clamp to make space for the hanging media. Snap the clamp onto the hanging medium with the socket open facing the ground. Tighten the screw and make sure the clamp is secure. Do not hang objects such as clothes on the device. Our ExtraCare 3600 pump comes with error alarms to ensure safe operation and use. The canister installation error alarm will sound when the canister is not detected or installed incorrectly. The device will not operate, the LED light will flash yellow, and the canister error symbol will appear on screen until the canister is properly installed. The high voltage error alarm will sound when there is a risk of voltage incompatibility. During operation, if the input voltage is greater than 16 volts when the device is being used with an adapter that is not recommended, the LED light will flash yellow and the adapter error symbol will appear on screen until the correct adapter is used. Failure to use the correct adapter may cause the fuse to blow out. Once there is less than 10% battery power remaining, an alarm will sound, the LED light will flash yellow and the low battery symbol will appear on screen. The pump will continue pumping until the battery is completely depleted. 
Plug in the ExtraCare 3600 into a wall outlet to allow it to charge and function at the same time. The ExtraCare 3600 will be fully charged after five hours. The canister error alarm will sound when the canister is full. The LED light will flash yellow and the canister full symbol will appear. The pump will shut off. Install a new canister to mediate the error and continue treatment. The leakage error alarm will sound if the pump is unable to reach 80% of the preset pressure after five minutes. The yellow LED will stay on constantly and the minor leakage error symbol will appear on screen. The pump will stay on. If the pump is unable to reach 50% of the preset pressure after two minutes of effort, the alarm will sound, the yellow LED will flash, and the major leakage error symbol will appear on screen. The pump will remain on, but will power off after 10 minutes of continuous alarm. To mediate a leakage alarm, inspect for possible air leaks between the wound and the extra care dressing, the extra care dressing and canister, and the canister and pump. If necessary, power the device off and on to restart the system after adjustment. If there is a blockage in the tubing or the dressing, the alarm will sound, the yellow LED will flash, and the blockage error symbol will appear on screen. The pump will continue to run. Replace with a new dressing and tubing set to remove the blockage. Devon Medical Products develops an exclusive line of advanced therapeutic medical devices for negative pressure wound therapy that is simple and effective for healthcare markets and patients worldwide. For more information, please contact us by email or phone at the information provided on screen.